so literally I'm getting ready for you, with you uh, to start my day and I just wanted to say that almost a year later after starting Senegence, actually let me uh, put on some cream here. This is my everyday solution. Um, this is what I use for my anti-wrinkle and pore minimizer. I love this stuff. It's one of my favorites. It smells great. It's all natural. It's vegan products made here in America. I take one, almost a three quarter pump because that's just how I feel most comfortable. And I put it, see there's zero makeup, just my moisturizer. And I just put it around my eyes and work my way up my forehead. So I've got those lovely small little wrinkles here and there. It's just everyday average skin. I'm uh, in my early 40s now, so I've just always taken care of my skin and my health to the best that I can um, and learning about good products and bad products along the way. And I always have been a person who goes to um, different places and uh, experiments with different things as far as makeup and cosmetics and skincare. So um, I have landed on my favorite Senegence products. They are healthy, clean products, good for me, good for you, and that's why I'm in it. I just want to help women succeed and enhance their natural beauty because we are born beautiful and the products that we put on our skin uh, help either promote that good, healthy, uh, genetic hormonal balance or it can go the other way and just completely deplete your balanced hormones and give you issues and problems in your life like uh, bad skin and causing more damage to that skin tissue. Uh, learning how to exfoliate is important, getting rid of that first dead layer um, and learning what products are healthy and good for you. And I love to support my country, so I'm. these products are made here in America. Um, and they're not terrible products, which you learn about a lot about other products and what they might have in it. And almost a year later, I still find products like hiding in places here and there. So I just kind of compile it just to give some people ideas. See, this is just regular eyeshadow. I'm not going to name any um, names of what they are. I just wanted to do a quick demonstration. I'm just grabbing a random brush. I know it's not the right brush, but it's just a random brush. And this is just, um, eyeshadow that I used to use. And it's kind of, I'll put it on. Oh, I can't really see it, but it is there. It's a little shimmery and sparkly and it's powder. So it just fluffs off. Um, it can make a mess. Um, and just, it's not healthy. It's not good for you. And it's just a bad product, uh, the things that are inside. So I'm going to toss it. It's gone forever in the trash. And I came across other products that I used to use also. Um, not naming names again, I'm just going to show you uh, just different products that I have used. I used to love, uh, and it's gone. Anyway, I used to love uh, pencil brushes, but they go on, just to give you an idea, they go on like this, pencil brushes. Uh, they're made of wax and leads. They smudge. They're not water resistant. And they come off. Look at that. If I went swimming and came out and just wiped my face with a cloth, that's what I would be left with. So no more, none of that mess because Senegence just doesn't have the mess. Uh, it's water resistant, good, healthy, clean products. So that's gonna be tossed. Let me wipe my arm. All right, it's gone. All right, so on the, on the other side of this, is my kind of fine tuning. This is a um, a brush that has, well, it's supposed to help me make fine lines, which it does. See those fine lines? So it does. But again, it smudges and it smears. I don't like that. And it's not water resistant. And when I get out of my pool, I, I have to 
uh, worry about a runny mess or that my makeup isn't there at the end of my day when I want it to. So tossing. I don't need these things anymore. I found what I have been looking for and I'm glad to part with my bad products. Um, the same goes for a lip liner. Um, so I love my lip liners. Uh, this is a, an example of a lip liner. Uh, pencils get, get sharp and shards and uh, tough to sharpen and get that fine point that you want without it breaking off or breaking off in the sharpener itself. So um, yeah, so just different issues and different problems occur with different products and I don't have to worry about any of that with Cenogens, so I love it. So this is an example of a just a generic um, lip liner. It again is waxy and glossy, uh, waxy and has lead and not glossy. Um, this is, it doesn't, I'm looking for the color. So this is the color of it by the way. So the color, this was my lip liner. I'd have to work Oh, here we go. See, it's in there. We have to work um, too hard and it will break. Oh, and it broke. So that, that is what happens. And then you lost all of that product. So let's do it like this. And then I'm going to darken my line and I'm, I'm putting pressure on it. And you have to go over it several, several times. With Lip Sense, Senegens, one and done. It's a good healthy clean product and I don't have to worry that I'm making a mess or this putting unhealthy junk on my skin and again this just rubs off and it it fades over time and when I get out of the pool or the ocean or the shower or actually not so much the shower but um just any water in general and I'm gonna smudge everything when I'm eating um say I'm eating a donut my lip my lip liner might stay on but my if that's another thing so toss so coming across other products so this is something I used to wear a lot um again I'm not gonna name any names because it's just not a, a fun and fair thing to do so I used to get tube lipstick and you know this is the waxy everyday wearing uh lipsticks so i would pair that up with my uh liner and i would put on my waxy um color so with this um you know say you're eating a morning donut on your way to work and you know that's just a couple rubs and it's gone so, or it smears and makes a mess, and then you have a light hint there, but the actual uh, reality of tube lipstick is, is just not there. Um, with, so I'm, I'm done with this. I'm satisfied that these are not clean and not healthy, good for me products, so they're gone. Um, what is good for me are my Lip Sense products, which do stay tried and true. I love them. I've had zero issues with them. It's been almost a year now and I'm very satisfied. My, um, my lip liners look like this. They go on like liquid gold. I appreciate it. Uh, two little beads inside, mix everything up. I'm not worried about breaking off a pencil, needing it to be sharpened or anything. This is really nice and smooth. Uh, it's got an easy layout just like that. It goes on nice and deep. One coat. You can go as many coats as you wish, but Um, but that is the difference. So, I mean, it's a no-brainer. I love these. And then it just has to dry. It takes just a little bit to dry and it stays on your skin all day long. So I love it. I never have to worry that it's going to come off in the water, um, or that it's going to come off on my food or my glasses or my drinks, or that I'm ingesting a product. I know that my products are clean and healthy. I know that my products are made here in America and not by some uh, little children in a foreign country that are, uh, I won't go into details. Anyway, so, uh, and Lip Sense goes on. I love the way it goes on. This, there's just like the, uh, lip liner, just smooth, 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 smooth. And that's a pretty deep, rich color right there. And that's four hours, four hours of long lasting lip wear. I mean, that is incredible. And then you can keep darkening the layers, uh, for, as many layers as you wish but it's recommended three um first layer make sure that it's dry it takes uh 
Well, I don't have it in here, but usually I have a little timer um, to show you to set your pace, a little sand timer. Um, it just gives you one whole minute to kind of pace yourself to set your, um, your lip sense the way you want it. Uh, so I don't have to worry about this. So I'm just, I'm just putting a few products on me just so that you can see the measurement. It's just beautiful. That's, that's just one and that's four hour wear. So that is just amazing. Um, that is, you can feel it drying. So it doesn't really take that long to dry and it is dry by now. And so this was the lip liner that I had put on my lip sense and it is not coming off. It's totally on there. It's bonded to my skin and it won't uh, rub or flake off or see if I work on that, that'll be gone. That'll be gone. And that's the other, um, that is the generic lip liner that I used to wear. And that's all smudgy and icky. This nice and clean and fresh all day. It looks like this all day long. I never have to worry about it. And here, this is already dry. It dries on like a mat and it is long lasting and it is there for the day. So um, if I wanted it to last for 18 hours, literally all I do is I add another layer. I add another layer just like that. And see how it gets deeper and richer? Every layer that you add gets deeper and richer. That's why it's so cool to mix and match these colors. Um, what else? So that while that is drying, I just wanted to share with you also one of my favorite. So what is this one? Okay. Um, so I still, like I said, I find different ones uh, that I've worn in the past. Uh, this is what a shadow sense looks like. This is eyeshadow. So I'm just going to show you eyeshadow. Uh, this is the shadow sense. It comes in a variety of different colors. You can use it with a, any brush you wish or the applicator itself, depending on fat, how fat you want your lines or how thin you want your lines or what creative process you're doing with that. But again, this is smudge proof and budge proof and it's just amazing. You can use it for uh, cat eyes, fish tails, stars, hearts, moons, diamonds, whatever you wish. Um, you can use it for a fun sporting function or Halloween time. Uh, it's just great and long lasting. So it's not going to smear or smudge. Um, it's not going to sweat off at the gym. So you never have to worry about that. And it's also water resistant. Um, as I showed you, here's another one. Oh no, this is, so this is a uh, brow care. Okay. So this is for brow care and they make it in package it. This is, I'm going to open the darn thing. Oh, see, it makes it tough to even open to show you. Here we go. So this is a brow care. This is a um, instance of brow care. I'm just going to grab a different brush. Grabbing a different brush to show you. Um, if you can see this, I'm not going to name names of what it is, but it's kind of um, like creamy, dry, and semi-flaky. Uh, this is how it goes on. So kind of smudgy, kind of eh. Um, can you draw fresh lines with it? Uh, you gotta work at it. You gotta work at it. So, and while I'm doing that, it's actually literally flaking off on my skin. Can you see those little flakes? So afterwards, I mean, it makes it, it makes a mess all over your face and you have to clean out those, um, little remnants to make it. And it doesn't come out nice and clean either. So with my, so this is junk, 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 junk. I don't want it. Um, just some little remnants that I have left over. So for, let's say for instance, so I just did brow care. Um, I can also, what I also like to do is use my shadow sense for my brow care. Uh, what I will do for that, because it's a shadow sense and it has an applicator that's fairly fat and you can see that. Um, I actually use a different brush. So for today, I'll just use this. I'm just priming it. Um, so it's just a regular brush. And I take just a little bit off there. And then for my uh, eyebrows, I can paint. Here we go. Running out of arm room. Okay, so here I'm gonna, I can paint my fibers in. You see that? 
I can paint my fibers in just little lines and I didn't have I didn't put too much product on here um, so I can paint my lines in and then I can smooth them out either with the same brush or a different brush depending on what I want my look and my design to be so again I use shadow sense on my brows and it works great so for me I'm a brunette so I use mocha java um, I also use garnet depending on, and the smoked topaz. So those are all good uh, shadow senses to use for brow care. Um, let's see. So again, I'm just getting ready for my day. So ready for my day, I've got to remember about me too. So this is my color correcting tinted moisturizer. This helps even out my red spots or my freckles or skin um, imperfections and just gives it a smooth, um, overall. So I'm very careful and measured in how I pump it out um, because I don't want to go fast and, and get product all over and I don't want, I don't need a lot of product. I kind of judge it on what I'm doing in my day. Um, I'm going out to help with getting ready for an event uh, here. So I'll be working behind the scenes and uh, busy with the labor work. So I am just using a little bit of this, as this is how I like my world. I put it in two fingers. I concentrate on two, two here first, and then I kind of spread it out with just a little bit there, just so that I can have a, uh, a larger um, surface to work with as I apply. So here, 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 and that's what I do. Make sure that you're blending into your neck as well, um, because you're all of you, down to your chest, um, and just working it out. So this is my so you've seen I've already put on my moisturizers, I put on my base, my solutions, and you don't have to wait long in between for them to dry. I just did because I talk. Talk, talk, talk. Just to show you guys. I mean, if I didn't do this, maybe you wouldn't know. Or maybe you already do and you're just getting along, getting ready along with me today, which is awesome. So, um, I'm just evening this out because balance is the key to life blending is the key to good makeup applications so we always want to be well balanced clean and healthy um i will do my hair after all i did was a quick blow dry that you you saw me do i did that right along with you um so i'm satisfied i just put an overall layer on making sure I'm blending and hopefully you can see everything that I've been doing because I have my mirror over here and you're over here so and I don't want to elongate this video too long for you because I know it, you have pressing things to do also um, I just wanted to go over some products so again this is what is this this is my um, Looks like my eyeliner. Sometimes I use my eyeliner as my um, lip liner in the past also, just because I can get a deep, rich, dark cocoa color in an um, eyeliner easier than I might be able to find it in a um, long-lasting lip color, lip care. So anyway, I'm all, I'm all done with those problem areas or trying to figure things out when it's just not what it is designed to do, uh, what is what it is there for. Um, so again, this is a twist. So I have to twist it up. Ah. And again, there's not much product left there, but I do wanted to show you how it applies. So again, I'm working at it. Ah. And there's just nothing coming out. So I'm gonna make sure I twisted it up all the way. Oh, well, anyway, so there is nothing left in this product anyway, but that's the thing. I mean, they, they run out and you don't know how much is left of them. Um, in these, you can pretty much see, let me grab you a shadow sense. So you can literally see how much product you have left in there. So it's very cool. Um, you can actually see these things. You can see right through the bottles to see how much product that you have left over um, and it gives you plenty of warning time so that you can go ahead and order another one um, without any lapse time so yeah 
So those are just some products. Oh, here's another one I found. So this is an eyeliner. So you open it up. There's the brush. I'll put it right next to shadow. And there's your eyeliner. So this is a liquid. I'm gonna wait till it dries. This is one of my old products. Um, Cause you still find them hanging around. I don't know, I think I've gotten rid of them all by now. I think so, but you never know. They pop up here and there. Uh, anyway, so, um, so they smudge, they move. If I had a little too much product or something on one end, it is there. So I, I don't like it. I don't like it. I found what I like. It's tried and true. My lipsticks don't move. My shadow senses are spot on. Um, I can work with my brow, my shadow senses for my brows. Um, I don't have to worry that I'm eating my lipsticks. So junky products. Uh, I don't have to worry that I'm not um, going to apply my makeup and go to the gym or go for a swim and then my makeup is like all uh, cruddy and runny. So I don't like that and I don't want to invest in the products that um, are designed to do that. I want a long lasting good healthy wear and I don't want any uh, things in there that's going to cause hormonal issues or problems. So I just want to make sure that um, people are aware that not all cosmetics and skincare are healthy. So you got to learn what's in there, um, make the best decisions and healthy choices. So um, this is what a beauty book looks like. This, these are the products that I sell. This is Senegence and Lip Sense, long lasting American vegan. I do have a Facebook page. I do have a YouTube channel. I do have a cell phone and a website. Uh, and an email so you, there's a variety of ways if you see me at an event I do plenty of events um, if you're in Massachusetts on Saturday you can come and see me at the Lemonster marketplace uh, right in the Lemonster uh, common downtown so that's where I'll be uh, lip gloss Liza anyway so I just wanted to share with you about some unhealthy products and some healthy products so um, that's a little bit about that there. Um, so if you have any questions or anything, just let me know. Um, for you, or with you, with you rather, did I do with my... Okay, so this is my Onyx. So I'm still getting ready for my day. I still have to take care of me. So I'll just continue to do that while I'm chatting um this is the month of may so happy may priming my brush happy may and in the month of may we have a fabulous sign-on bonus uh the sign-on bonus is okay if you can see i'll try to back up um sign-on bonus for 55 dollars is always either the membership fee that you pay for your own self to get some great discounts all year you can get 20 percent discounts on all your products no matter how little or how much you buy you could get a 20 percent discount uh the more that you buy of course is the bigger the discount i can show you how to earn uh 50 off of all of your products uh, in the month of May, we're having a special where you, for $55 sign-up fee, which lasts for the whole year, uh, you can get $55 worth of free product. So it's really amazing. Um, the different kits and supplies that are out there right now are fabulous, spot on. Beauty books come in two different languages, uh, the Spanish and the English version are available. And those are just great to show you all about the different uh, products that we do have. And there, there's a new beauty book coming out because we've got some new colors. Um, some beautiful new colors. We got a blue jay color that is a pretty bold uh, cobalt blue. So that's pretty fun. Um, if you are a gal who loves the vivid colors, um, we have like a mod magenta, uh, that's a beautiful color. We have um, the violet volt, that's an awesome purple. Um, we have so many different colors, there's, there's over 50 colors. So if I stood here and just went down the list of all 50 colors, we could be here literally all day. So um, I'm not gonna do that. 
but I am going to continue getting ready for my day. Um, I should have done this in the beginning. It's just put my hair up because it's always getting in the way. So I always try to do something different with my hair. Um, I had a lot longer hair and then I chopped it all off and it takes a while to grow back. You can do some fun things with short hair versus longer hair that kind of gets weighed and heavy, but um, all, all different hair lengths you can do so much with. So I'm just pulling this back here. There. And I'm satisfied. Now oh, here's some more products. Oh, this used to be one of my favorite palettes. Um, just to show you, I'm just going to take the same brush and these are the um, the eyeshadows. So they go on like this. And they just give you a hint and they don't stay. And they're very um, messy. I'll say they're messy because you put them on your eyes and they end up on your cheeks and down to your jawline sometimes. So you just kind of have to um, clean up what you've already cleaned up. So it's just double time. I'm tossing. So I found the colors that I love. I found the trios that I love. Um, I adore my everything that I found through Cenogents, uh that works for me. This is my Mocha Java. It's one of my favorite bases. I'll take this as my base. I put it right on just like this. It doesn't take long. You've seen me do this before. I know, I know, I don't want to seem too repetitive, but every video is different and you might get something different out of each one. So of course you would. And I just prime my brush on my skin always. And then I just take it from the corners. And this is just my base going up to my brow. I also use the same Mocha Java for my personal brows. Um, if I wanted to do a little bit uh, more contrast, I'll go in with a darker color such as Garnet or Topaz. So, And then I'll definitely use a different um, brush for each one. But for today, what I'm doing and where I'm going, I'm just needing to uh, get some elbow grease and work out. So I'm constantly doing something and it's good to stay active and be energetic and the more that you can do for yourself and your community, uh, your children and your family, it's just, it's beautiful. Um, and taking care of a healthy planet also, which I, I know and I feel and I am uh, supporting good, healthy, clean causes. So my makeup products can be my base for that. Um, funny. I, I pulled this out. This is my base. Sometimes I'll use this as my primer, my base. Uh, this is a Snow White and it just, it goes on underneath everything to make it a, a clean, crisp white canvas to work over. Um, and any eye color that you put over this uh, really pops. So it's really great. Um, like I said, I'll also use this sometimes as a highlighter. So I'll just highlight. This works great for also contouring to give you that contrast. I'll go in with a Mocha Java and then I'll contrast it with a white or a light pink. Um, the blushes, the blushes are amazing too. Just a little dab will do you. And you can do some nice contouring with that. I love the brush, the blushes because the blush you can use for, you know, natural cheek color. Um, you can use it for uh, the contouring. You can, versatility. Okay, that's what I love. And Sunogens provides versatility. Um, you say, heard me say that before, I'll say it again, and I'll, I'll continue to say it because I love that. I love that so much, that one product can do so much. If I have a blush sense with me and I didn't apply any makeup, I could easily just use it here for adding a little color. Uh, if I had a Mocha Java with it, I could use it with the Mocha Java to give myself a little contouring. I can use it on my for my shadows, I can use it for my lips, so blush is amazing. It's just amazing, amazing. All all of these products. I know I might use the word amazing quite a lot, but it is just so excellent and terrific. Um, so you can apply as much as you want or as little as you want. It's totally buildable, totally up to you and your lifestyle, your dreams and wishes and, and what have you. Um, so I based myself with my Mocha Java. Um, you saw me put on my liner, which is actually a shadow sense. Um, let's see. 
I'm talking a lot, so I'm kind of avoiding my lip area, but I go in with my my lip liner. This comes in a variety of different colors. Uh, we have a nice uh, purple or pink or neutral or a cocoa. Uh, this happens to be a terracotta. This is an awesome color. I like this. Um, it blends with pretty much any, any of these will blend with any color that you choose or a gloss or whatever. If you just wanted to put a lip liner on a gloss over that, that's totally cool too. Um, so we do have for 120, we have a half a dozen glosses right now and it's part of the limited edition. So when it, when it is, when it does come, when a product comes out as a limited edition, it's only here for a certain amount of time and it's anybody's guess. I don't know if the company makes a lot or, or a certain number that they come out with and then once all of them are gone, that's it. They take them off, but there have been products in the past like my Glam Doll. I love Glam Doll. It's one of my favorite favorites and I'm running really low on it, which is a Lip Sense color. It was part of a limited edition. I really hope that they do come back with that because I'll scoop it up again. Um, so we just want to make sure when it says limited edition, it really is a limited edition and we never know how or when it's going to sell out. So when you see that, you want to jump on that. If you like it, get it. So this is my lip liner. Clean, dry surface. Just suck it in like a vacuum. I'm drying it out. You can use a, a, a pad, cosmetic pad. You can use a, um, I'll show you. You can use a uh, tooth, I was gonna call it a toothpick, a Q-tip, <laughs> sorry. Sometimes when I go fast or I know I have to be somewhere and do something, I try, tend to rush through my videos and then someone will reply and, and say, hey, I wish you'd slow down. So I never, you know, it's, you never know. So you just go with your pace and what works for you. That's a cool thing about owning your own business. You can work at your own pace. You can hold, um, you can be a stay at home mom. It's perfect for stay at home moms because you really get to dedicate your time and hone in on your company and your business. Um, it's really great. So if you want to join the team, send me a PM and we'll chat. Uh, it's easy to do. It's $55 to sign up and you get that right back in your free products. So it's cool. Here I go. You, oh, and by the way, you can save it for yourself. You can keep the discount all year long to buy products at your cho at your um, pace. You can share it with others. Uh, you can sell it and make your money back. So whatever. Again, it's versatility. Versatility. I love it. So lip liner. I'm standing away from my mirror so that I can get you in my frame as well. So I'm just outlining my lips. That's all I'm doing, outlining my lips. One, two, three. I did one, two, and my bottom. And lip liner is cool too because you can actually uh, contour the shape of your lips. Um, depending on where you're going, what your function is, what your colors are, uh, if you're wearing glitter or your Whatever your choices are as far as what you're doing, maybe you're going out for a photo shoot and you want those nice juicy plump lips, um, I ha that you can shape your lips with a lip liner. It's really cool. I love it. Uh, you can also plump up your lips with a lip volumizer for 50 bucks, which is great. It's When you see solutions on my page or my products, these solutions really work. They grow your lashes, they grow your brows, they grow your nails. They work with your skin. The collagen night pack, it works with your skin to rebuild your own collagen because it's just amazing. And when you learn more about your health and your wealth and your well-being and who you are and um, how your skin is, your hormone levels and everything, you can work on self-balance and hone in on whatever your particular issue is and there is a solution for it somehow some way um, and if you don't know how or exactly what it is that's when you reach out you can reach out to me or we don't know depending on what the issue is but I can help you solve that problem uh, anonymously through a PM um, so I can work with you you can work with me and we'll figure this out together okay um, so lip liner, that's what that is.
uh, lip liner. This is here. That was, and it's still smudge proof and budge proof. It's still water resistant. It's still gonna last for 18 hours. It is a beautiful, healthy, clean product. Um, this was two layers of the lip scents. So again, it's the same as the lip liner. And this is the lip scents, over 50 shades. Um, so like I said, I'm just getting ready for a regular average day. Sometimes I go in at random in my little bag, my cosmetic bag filled with my different things. And sometimes I'll just randomly pick out a color like I just did. So Roseberry it is. Roseberry it is. So I'm gonna shake it up just like I did the um, lip liner. Drying out my waterline. Waterline is inside, inside of your lip. It needs to work on a clean, dry surface because it bonds, it bonds to your skin. It doesn't just gloss over like oh, the wax product that I showed you. Um, see, it's not even there. Um, I did, it was here, but we blended that right away, it's gone. So that's just a, a wax-based cover. This is a deep set beauty. So that's the difference. So I'm just gonna apply it. And you can talk all day long like I do, sometimes. <laughs> uh, sometimes my job, I just have to talk all day and work through different issues and solve problems and things like that. So I don't have to worry that my lipstick has come off. Uh, so you can feel it drying. And to speed it up, I, I fan. You can sing, play music, hop along, whatever you wanna do to get ready for your day. Um, I just tend to make it not so noisy for you. Um, I shut my door, so kiddos are already off to school. It's kind of a quiet house. It's just me and my oldest. We have uh, a special errand to take care of today, as I told you earlier. And my doggies are out um, outside, so they won't be disturbing. Uh, sometimes they come and paw at the door. They hear me talking. They're like, who's she talking to? <laughs> And it's me talking to you. <laughs> so again, you don't want a lot of product. You don't need a lot of product. Uh, and the drying time is faster if you don't use a lot of product. The trick to it, tip and trick to lip scents, is making sure it's on a clean, dry surface and that each layer is dry before you apply the next layer. Those are the tips and tricks. Here we go. So that's my second layer. You can feel it start drying immediately. There's no, you don't want to rub your lips together. That does absolutely nothing. If it was a waxy mess, well, the waxy mess, as you saw right there, if I'm going to rub my lips together, it is going to go get on both sides. I guess that's what's uh, appealing about that. And it does give you a lip color, but it's not very long lasting. Um, I, do, I love lip scents. I love lip scents. That's why I'm Lip Boss Liza and I love it, love it, love it. And I love you too. So I want you to feel good about your products that you're using, that they're working for you. <laughs> okay, and then my final layer, because I'm satisfied of how dry this is. This is my final layer of lip scents. Just one more little layer. And anybody can pull off any color. Every single color is so beautiful. And since we have three layers, gives you the longest lasting, which is 18 hours, you can literally choose any three colors and put them together and make new looks. You can get 27 new looks every single day for 27 days. You can get a different color lip by just um, putting different colors together, different layering. Um, randomly, if you have these three colors, you can go one layer, two layer, three layer, okay? 
and then the next day you can switch it up your first layer becomes your second layer and then first top coat I mean undercoat second coat top coat and then you can you can just continue doing that and rotate all your colors for 27 days three colors I mean it's amazing how it's so cool and one of these lasts oh I already checked it uh, one of these is the same amount of four tubes of lipstick so I mean bang for your buck is right there 25 bucks how much do you pay for each tube of lipstick that's just a waxy mess that does this it smudges it might give you a little color for a little while but if you you know it ladies if you eat um, if you eat something you're eating that lipstick so all those waxy, junky, um, imbalanced hormonal things that you might be putting on your lips uh, and ingesting into your body uh, or has animal parts and pieces inside. I mean, it's atrocious when you start learning about this. Um, I have a PETA event in a couple days here and I'm just a, a PETA lover. I love my animals. I'm a very a huma I'm humanitarian at heart and I just or on the surface. I mean, I'm, I'm all about my animals and my people, my network, my causes. Um, if you know me personally, you know all about that and who I am. So um, I just wanted to give you a few options, explain more about clean and healthy products. Right now I'm just looking for a gloss because my gloss, my glosses seal. Now this is dry like a mat. It's dry like a mat. This is Roseberry. Um, so, and this is my glossy gloss that I put right over my lip scents. When the third layer is dry, this is made of shea butter, which is healing and sealing. And it's just what it says. It, it's just like butter. It's smooth like butter. It's beautiful. It's glossy. I love it. It feels sensational. So you can bring your gloss with you and gloss as many times as you feel necessary. Uh, there's no need to reapply your lip scents because it stays all day. Um, your gloss you can apply this as many times as you want. Um, key to life, just stay balanced, stay healthy, uh, eat, sleep, and exercise, um, and just keep loving yourself. Keep loving yourself and who you are. Um, just look through your own everything. You can do your own researches um, and just... Yeah, if you have any questions, send me a PM. Join my team. I'd love to have you. Uh, you can go right alongside with me or you can be in California and we can do it by um, FaceTimes. I have a Glamour Girls team, uh, so that is just perfect. There are so many ladies around um, throughout United States and Canada and Australia and it's, it's just growing and growing and growing. So, so many people have caught on to how clean and healthy these products are for you and it's just a wonderful experience. So I want to share that with you. Um, that's all for today. So thank you for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>